Have you ever lost something you thought was forever? That moment may have been your first lesson on impermanence. Imagine for a moment the last time you said goodbye to a loved one. Perhaps it was a temporary farewell, or perhaps a goodbye with no return. In that instant, amidst the pain and longing, a silent teaching revealed itself. Nothing in our existence is permanent. Today, let's dive together into this universal truth of impermanence, exploring not only how it shapes every aspect of our lives, but also how it can teach us to live more fully, consciously, and gratefully. Impermanence, this constant transformation, can be our ally, inspiring a deep appreciation for every moment and every connection. So, I invite you, open your heart and mind to this journey. Let me show you how this perception can transform the way you see the world, your relationships, and most importantly, yourself. 1. Impermanence in personal relationships. Impermanence, an undeniable truth of our existence, permeates all facets of life, including our personal relationships. Have you ever stopped to ponder how attachment to loved ones, such as family and friends, shapes our understanding of this impermanence? When we form deep emotional bonds, these connections become pillars of our human experience, enriching our lives with joy, support and love. However, these same bonds confront us with the ephemeral nature of life. Every shared moment, every created memory is a gentle reminder that nothing is permanent. What does this impermanence really mean in our lives? Does it teach us to value each moment more with those we love? Or does it leave us with a sense of melancholy, pondering the inevitable farewell? By clinging, we create expectations and build our worlds around the constant presence of these loved ones. But the reality is that change is inevitable. People come and go from our lives, whether by personal choice, circumstances, or the natural cycle of life and death. However, it is precisely this impermanence that can teach us valuable lessons. It urges us to live the present moment more intensely, to express our love and gratitude openly, without delay. Impermanence challenges us to be more resilient, to find beauty in the transience of life, and to grow from the losses we will inevitably face. Imagine for a moment what life would be like if everything were permanent. Constancy, while it may seem comforting, could also lead us to complacency, depriving us of the motivation to grow, change, and truly appreciate the value of each moment. So how can we navigate this reality of impermanence in our relationships? How can we keep our hearts open, knowing that goodbye is a natural part of the cycle of life? The answer may lie in the practice of acceptance and deep appreciation of the present moment, allowing ourselves to fully feel joy, pain, longing and love without resisting or trying to control the uncontrollable is a way to honor the beauty of our relationships despite their ephemeral nature. I invite you to take a moment to think about your own experiences of attachment and impermanence. How have these experiences shaped who you are today? And more importantly, how can they inspire you to live a fuller and more meaningful life, cherishing each person and each moment as if they were unique? Because at the end of the day, perhaps impermanence isn't just a source of pain, but also a precious teacher about the true meaning of love and life. 2. Impermanence in the Universe have you ever wondered about the constant change that governs everything around us, from the most majestic natural phenomena to the inanimate objects that populate our daily lives? The universe at its core is a stage of incessant changes. Stars are born and die in supernova explosions. Galaxies collide and merge in cosmic dances of unimaginable scale. And even planets and their climates are subject to transformations that reshape their faces over the ages. This universal fluidity serves as a humble reminder that nothing, absolutely nothing, remains the same. The rivers that flow, 
The mountains that slowly erode, and even the continents that slowly shift, are witnesses to impermanence. Even inanimate objects, which at first glance seem static and unchanging, are subject to this universal law. Cities and civilizations that once flourished now lie in ruins, whispering stories of glory and decline to the ears of eternity. This constant metamorphosis of the universe can make us feel small, ephemeral, but it can also be a source of fascination and inspiration. Think of the beauty found in the changing of seasons, the renewal brought by spring after the harshness of winter, or the majestic transformation of a caterpillar into a butterfly. These natural cycles teach us about renewal, resilience, and the wonder of transformation. But what does this constant change mean for us, beings who seek stability and security in a world that is always in flux? The answer may lie in our ability to appreciate and find meaning in movement, transformation, and impermanence itself. Instead of resisting change, we can embrace it as an opportunity to grow, learn, and reinvent ourselves. In this context, each moment becomes an invitation to be fully present, to observe and participate in the dance of the universe, with the awareness that we are part of this continuous movement. By recognizing and accepting impermanence on a cosmic scale, we are invited to reflect on what we truly value, on how we want to spend our precious time, and on how we can contribute to the eternal becoming of the universe. So the next time you gaze at the starry sky, consider the countless transformations that have occurred so that you could witness this beauty. Allow this awareness of universal impermanence to broaden your perception of life, instigating a deep appreciation for each moment and each experience as precious and unique gifts from the cosmos. 3. Law of Rhythm The Law of Rhythm, one of the seven hermetic laws, reveals a profound truth about the nature of the universe. Everything is in constant motion and vibration. This law teaches us that just as planets follow their predetermined orbits and tides, ebb and flow in response to lunar attraction. Every aspect of the universe dances to the rhythm of an endless cyclical pattern. This idea, although it may seem abstract at first glance, has profound implications for how we perceive the reality around us. By understanding that every atom in our body and in the world around us vibrates at specific frequencies, we begin to understand how matter is not as solid as it seems. It is instead an orchestra of energy in constant motion. But how does this vibration influence our perception of matter and reality? And how can we apply the law of rhythm to improve our lives and achieve greater harmony with the universe? Firstly, by accepting that everything is in constant motion, we recognize that change is the only constant. This realization can help us embrace life transitions with more grace and fluidity, rather than resisting them. Understanding the natural rhythm of things allows us to anticipate and, to some extent, prepare for the phases of growth and retreat that we experience on our personal journey. Moreover, by tuning into the vibration of atoms and energy around us, we can begin to consciously influence our own reality. Through practices such as meditation, creative visualization, and positive affirmation, we can adjust our vibrational frequency to resonate with what we wish to attract into our lives. It's a powerful reminder that we are co-creators of our experience, capable of shaping our existence through alignment with universal laws. The law of rhythm also teaches us about the importance of balance. Just as there are moments of action, there are moments of rest. Nature does not hurry, yet everything is accomplished. By incorporating this understanding into our lives, we can find a healthy balance between doing and being, between effort and surrender, learning to flow with the natural cycles of life rather than fighting against them. Finally, by contemplating vibration and how it influences our perception of matter, 
we are invited to recognize that at a fundamental level, everything in the universe is connected. This vibrational interconnection serves as a reminder of our unity with the whole, encouraging actions and thoughts that promote harmony, compassion and mutual understanding. Thus, the law of rhythm encourages us to dance to the rhythm of the universe, to celebrate impermanence and to consciously co-create our experience, recognizing the intrinsic beauty of the eternal movement that surrounds us. Four. Movement and change in natural phenomena and the human body. A deeply rooted concept of the universe, it manifests itself fascinatingly in both natural phenomena and the complex system that is the human body. This idea, when explored further, reveals how internal movements and chemical reactions are living examples of this constant transformation, reflecting the inherent transitoriness of existence. In the natural world, phenomena such as the cycle of seasons, the ebb and flow of tides, and the eruption of volcanoes testify to the incessant dance of change. The seasons of the year, with their succession of life, death, and rebirth, teach us about the impermanence of life and the beauty found in transformation. Tides, influenced by the gravitational forces of the moon and the sun, show us that even the oceans, in their vastness, are subject to a constant rhythm of change. Volcanoes, with their power of destruction and creation, reshape landscapes, demonstrating the regenerative force of the Earth. Similarly, the human body is a microcosm of movement and change, a miniature universe where billions of chemical reactions occur every second. Every breath we take, every heartbeat, is a reminder of our participation in this continuous flow of life. The cells of our body are in a perpetual state of renewal. Some divide and multiply, while others die and are replaced, maintaining the balance and health of the organism. This cellular cycle is an echo of impermanence, a reminder that change is the essence of life. Furthermore, the aging process, although often culturally resisted, is one of the most tangible expressions of impermanence. It shows us that change is inevitable, reflecting the transitory nature of our physical existence. However, even in the face of this transience, there is underlying beauty and an opportunity for growth and personal development. Accepting aging as an integral part of life can teach us to value each moment and cultivate a deeper appreciation for the experiences that make up our journey. Therefore, as we contemplate movement and change, both in nature and in ourselves, we are reminded that everything flows, everything changes, and nothing remains the same. This is a truth that, once embraced, can transform our way of seeing the world and relating to it, encouraging us to cultivate an attitude of openness, flexibility, and gratitude in the face of life's wonderful dance. 5. Reaction to Changes The reaction to changes and fluctuations in life is a fascinating aspect of human behavior, deeply influenced by our attachments and ego. These reactions vary widely among individuals and lie on a spectrum ranging from staunch resistance to graceful acceptance. This panorama reveals much about human nature and the strategies we can employ to navigate the often turbulent waters of change. At its core, attachment, whether to people, possessions, identities or ideas, plays a crucial role in how we perceive and react to change. When we are deeply attached to something, the idea of losing or altering it can evoke a range of emotions from anxiety and fear to sadness and grief. This fear of loss rooted in attachment often leads us to resist changes, even when they could be beneficial in the long run. The ego, in turn, reinforces this resistance by encouraging a rigid identification with certain aspects of our lives. It tells us that we are our achievements, our relationships, our social roles, and this identification creates a barrier against change. 
The ego seeks security and predictability and continuity, making it challenging to embrace the inherent impermanence of life. However, change is a constant, a fundamental truth of the universe. Confronted with this reality, we may find ourselves in a state of internal struggle. But why is this resistance so common? The answer may lie in how we are conditioned to perceive change, not as an opportunity for growth and renewal, but as a threat to our sense of security and identity. Fortunately, there are paths that lead to acceptance and adaptation. One such path involves developing self-awareness and understanding that our true essence goes beyond any identification with ego or objects of attachment. By cultivating this awareness, we can begin to see change not as a loss, but as a natural evolution of life, an opportunity to explore new facets of ourselves and the world around us. Another path involves strengthening emotional resilience, the ability to face challenges, adapt to new circumstances and grow from them. This implies embracing vulnerability, allowing ourselves to fully feel the emotions that accompany change without judgment or resistance and learning from them. Furthermore, practices such as meditation and mindfulness can help us disidentify from the ego and attachments, bringing greater inner peace and the ability to flow with the changes of life. By becoming more present and conscious, we can respond to life's fluctuations with greater balance and understanding. Therefore, as we navigate the changes of life, influenced by our attachments and ego, we have the opportunity to grow, expand our awareness, and find beauty in the transience of existence. Change, with all its uncertainties and opportunities, invites us to explore the depth of our being and rediscover the constantly evolving world around us. 6. Law of Cause and Effect Here we encounter an undeniable truth, a universal law that governs every fragment of our reality, the law of cause and effect. Have you ever wondered why certain things happen in your life? Or how today's actions shape our tomorrow? Let's dive together into this reflection, discovering how our deeds reverberate through time and space, weaving the fabric of destiny. Every choice we make, every word we utter, sends a ripple into the ocean of the universe, whose echoes return to us, sooner or later, with surprising precision. This is the essence of the law of cause and effect. For every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. But as beings in constant evolution, how do we embrace this truth, recognizing the ephemeral nature of our existence? Impermanence, this constant companion on our journey, teaches us to let go, to accept that nothing, absolutely nothing, remains the same. Everything flows, everything changes. Just as the seasons transform, our lives are in constant flux. Have you ever noticed how liberating it is to accept that everything around us is in a perpetual state of transformation? Now consider this. By understanding and accepting impermanence, are we not empowering ourselves? By recognizing that each moment is transient, we take each step with greater awareness, knowing that the seeds we plant today are the fruits of tomorrow. Doesn't this give you a sense of responsibility, but also of freedom? Let's delve a little deeper. How can you apply the law of cause and effect in your life, accepting the impermanence of all things? Imagine your daily actions as small seeds of intention that you plant in the fertile soil of the universe. Some of these seeds will grow, flourish and bear fruit, while others will not. And that's perfectly fine. The beauty lies in the journey, in the learning, in the growth. I'll share with you a personal story, a moment in my life when the law of cause and effect was profoundly revealed. Once, faced with a crossroads, I chose the less traveled path, driven by intuition and faith in the unknown. This decision, although scary at the time, set off a chain of events that brought me to where I am today. Looking back, I see how every choice, every step, was essential to my evolution. 
and you. Are you ready to embrace impermanence with courage, to recognize the beauty and freedom it brings? Are you prepared to plant your seeds with intention, knowing that while the outcome may not be in our hands, the act of planting is itself a gesture of hope and faith in the future? I invite you then to reflect on your actions, on the marks you wish to leave on the world. Remember, every step counts, every gesture carries weight. Together, in this community of souls in search, we can make a difference, weaving a tapestry of causes and effects that reflects the best of us. 7. Acceptance and preparation for change. Now we're diving into another dimension of our journey, one that invites us to contemplate the ever-changing nature of existence and to embrace transformation as an integral part of life. This chapter of our exploration leads us to understand the importance of acceptance and preparation for change. Have you ever stopped to think how life is like a kaleidoscope, always spinning, presenting us with new colors, patterns and possibilities? Change, though inevitable, can be scary, bewildering. However, it is precisely in this uncertainty that an extraordinary opportunity for growth and renewal lies. How then can we prepare ourselves emotionally and psychologically for these unexpected twists of fate? How can we diminish the impact of these transformations, not just surviving, but thriving amidst them? Firstly, it's essential to cultivate acceptance. Acceptance doesn't mean resigning or giving up, but acknowledging and embracing reality as it presents itself with all its complexity and beauty. When we accept, we release the internal resistance that often amplifies our suffering. But how do we reach this state of acceptance? One way is by practicing mindfulness, being fully present in the moment, observing our thoughts and emotions without judgment. This allows us to recognize that, although we can't control everything around us, we have the ability to choose how we react to the situations life presents us. Furthermore, psychological preparation involves cultivating resilience, the ability to bounce back in the face of adversity. This can be achieved by strengthening our support network, seeking out people who encourage and inspire us, and also developing a positive internal dialogue that reminds us of our strength and capacity to overcome. Now let me share a personal experience that illustrates the beauty of transformation. During a period of great uncertainty in my life, I felt like I was walking on a tightrope, unsure where to place the next step. It was a time of deep introspection during which I learned the importance of opening up to new experiences, of going with the flow of life, trusting that somehow I would be guided to safe shores. This experience taught me that by preparing ourselves emotionally and psychologically for changes, we can find peace and serenity, even in the storm. How can you prepare for the inevitable changes that life will bring? How can you cultivate acceptance and resilience, turning challenges into opportunities for growth? Remember, each of us is a skilled navigator in this ocean of life, capable of adjusting the sails in the face of the winds of change, heading towards uncharted destinations. May this reflection serve as a beacon, guiding you through the turbulent waters of transformation towards horizons of infinite possibilities. Together, we can face impermanence with courage, preparing ourselves to embrace changes, not as storms that come to destroy, but as winds that propel us towards new adventures, new learnings, and new beginnings. 8. The importance of becoming stronger. How can we become stronger beings, capable of facing tough times with determination and perceiving reality with greater clarity? Strengthening oneself is a continuous journey, a daily practice of self-awareness, self-development and recognition of our own vulnerabilities and strengths. But why is it so crucial to cultivate this inner strength? Because life, with all its beauty, also brings moments of shadow and storm. 
Being prepared for these moments doesn't just mean surviving them, but also learning, growing and eventually flourishing, thanks to the lessons they teach us. To strengthen yourself, start by looking inward, recognizing your emotions, thoughts and reactions. Ask yourself, what are these sensations trying to teach me? Self-inquiry is a powerful tool for personal growth, as it allows us to understand our internal mechanisms and how we can improve our response to challenges. The practice of gratitude is also fundamental. By focusing on the things we are grateful for, we shift our perspective from what we lack to what we possess. This not only lifts our emotional state, but also prepares us to face adversities with a more resilient mindset. Furthermore, cultivating a growth mindset is essential. Believing that we can learn and evolve with each experience turns perceived failures and challenges into opportunities for improvement. Viewing life as a series of lessons rather than a sequence of obstacles changes our relationship with difficult moments. What concrete actions can you take to start this journey of strengthening, whether through meditation, reflective writing, engaging in supportive communities, or seeking out new knowledge? The important thing is to take the first step. Remember, strength doesn't lie in the absence of vulnerability, but in the ability to face life with courage, compassion, and resilience. May this be the beginning of a transformative journey towards a stronger version of yourself, prepared to face everything that life has to offer. 9. The Ideal State of Neutrality What does it really mean to be in a state of neutrality, and how can this pursuit help us stay centered amidst relentless external changes? Neutrality here shouldn't be confused with indifference or apathy. On the contrary, it's about a position of power and balance, where we stand above polarities, observing events around us without being swept away by extreme reactions. Being neutral means having the ability to face the storm without losing our calm, to see change without drowning in the ocean of emotions it can unleash. How can we cultivate this neutrality, this center of serenity in our lives? First, it's crucial to develop self-awareness. This involves delving deeply into our inner selves, recognizing our emotional triggers, our reactive tendencies, and then consciously working to respond rather than react to the events around us. This is an act of personal power, a step towards self-mastery. Additionally, it's important to cultivate mental flexibility, understanding that there are multiple perspectives for each situation allows us to maintain an open mind and avoid rigidly clinging to specific opinions or emotions. This openness is crucial for maintaining neutrality, as it enables us to see beyond black and white, embracing the complexity and nuance of life. In a particularly revealing moment of my own journey, I discovered the power of neutrality during a conflict. Instead of immediately taking sides, I sought to understand the viewpoints of all parties involved, maintaining a state of calm observation. This approach not only allowed me to act more wisely, but also helped me maintain inner peace, regardless of the external chaos. Remember, neutrality is not a final destination, but a continuous journey of self-discovery, growth, and balance. May we all strive for this state of serenity and power, navigating the waves of life with grace, wisdom, and above all, a tranquil heart. 10. Positive Perspective on Impermanence Imagine for a moment that you're standing before a rushing river. See how its waters flow freely, never staying the same. Each passing wave, each flowing current, is a vivid reminder of the impermanence that governs not only nature, but also our own lives. So how can we view impermanence in a positive light? Firstly, it's essential to recognize that impermanence isn't a destructive force, but rather the natural rhythm of existence. Just as the seasons follow one another with their peculiarities and beauties, our lives are also in constant flux, offering us new opportunities with each dawn. 
But how can we embrace this continuous change? Every moment of transition is a chance for personal growth. Think of the times when an unexpected ending led us to new beginnings, perhaps more aligned with our true selves. Job changes, relationship endings, geographical moves, though challenging, force us out of our comfort zone, encouraging us to develop new skills, deepen our resilience and rediscover dormant passions. What changes have you faced and how have they contributed to your growth? Impermanence teaches us to value the present moment, inspiring a deep sense of gratitude for every experience, whether seemingly good or bad. When we understand that nothing is permanent, we begin to appreciate more intensely the small joys of everyday life, from a meaningful encounter to the simple pleasure of a sunny afternoon. What fleeting moments have you underestimated? Becoming aware of impermanence encourages us to live more fully, to make decisions aligned with our deepest values, and to pursue what genuinely makes us happy. Instead of postponing dreams and passions for some day that may never come, why not act now? After all, if not now, when? I invite each of you to reflect on how impermanence manifests in your lives. What changes have you been resisting? What steps can you take today to embrace the fluidity of life with courage and optimism? Remember, Impermanence is not an obstacle, but a path to a richer and more meaningful life. Impermanence is the background music of our existence, a melody that invites us to dance with flexibility, acceptance and joy. By facing it not as a threat, but as an opportunity to grow, be grateful and live intensely, we open the doors to a journey of endless discovery and contentment. May each of you find beauty in the transience of every moment and thus weave a life full of stories, lessons and unforgettable moments. I thank you for being here and I hope this video marks the beginning of a transformative journey toward a more robust version of yourself. Remember, impermanence surrounds us, shaping every breath and moment. How will you choose to dance with this eternal truth? Let us know in the comments. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and subscribe to support us. I'll soon bring more important content like this one here for you. See you soon.